Hello and welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to a new edition of the Daily Debate. In tonight's show, we're going to be focusing on the governmental uh, efforts exerted by the presidency and the government to really stem out and uh, reach the social care for millions of Egyptian citizens through the many initiatives uh, such as uh, Dignity and Solidarity and the Decent Life Initiative. We're also going to be taking a look at uh, the governmental efforts regarding controlling the prices of the basic food commodities and also uh, making sure all the needed uh, commodities are available on the shelves. But before we start doing that, let's check out a couple of the stories making the news today. And we'll start off with President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi, who instructed a comprehensive development uh, for Nasser Institute through increasing its capacity and raising the efficiency of its infrastructure to become a research hub and integrated medical center. The President's directives came during a meeting to follow up on the ongoing national projects in the sectors of health, education and scientific research. Presidential spokesman Bassam Radi said that President Assisi also ordered to establish the Egyptian Academy for Mathematics on the level of world academies. The meeting reviewed the most important activities of the British College for Doctors and Surgeons in Glasgow, which will start this year to provide training programs and scholarship exams in several specialities, including dentistry and uh, ophthalmology to students of Ain Shams University. In this regard, the head of state directed to establish a new headquarters for the British College in the new administrative capital. Meanwhile, the president was briefed on the latest developments of the national projects for comprehensive health insurance and plasma, as well as the latest developments of the coronavirus pandemic. And President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi held another meeting on Monday with Prime Minister Mustafa Medbouli and a number of ministers to review the latest developments concerning the establishment of a unified national network for emergency and public safety. During the meeting, President al-Sisi was briefed on the progress report of several projects in some governorates, a step to circulate the new system across the nation through connecting emergency units and vital facilities as ambulances and healthcare authorities, as well as sectors of petroleum, electricity and traffic devices. The President instructed to boost coordination among the concerned parties of the state to ensure the optimal operation for this integrated system and achieve its set main targets to accelerate dealing and responding of the state bodies to manage emergencies and crises in a short period of time. These were a couple of the stories making the news today, but now turning our attention to tonight's topic, let's check out this report regarding the president directing the government to control the prices of commodities, bread, and to support the wheat farmers. Let's check out this report and we'll be right back. <laughs> 